Hey guys, so I just wanted to record a quick update. Um, I don't want to take too long, and as you guys have probably figured out by now, anyone who knows me at least, um, I don't normally write anything down or you know rehearse what I'm going to say or anything. It's all just kind of off the cuff, so um, I don't anticipate this being more than a few minutes, but I just wanted to be kind of transparent with everybody about what's been going on, what is going to go on, and what I hope goes on, and you know, etc, etc. So, um, having a little bit of a, I guess, a, a tougher time in just life in general right now. Um, you know, I recently moved to Ontario, um, living in a basement, and I had future plans looking up and I mean I still do but you know things have have taken detours as they often do um, so when I moved here from Winnipeg uh, at the end of September early October um, I was still working a job that I had been working for just a little over seven years uh, where I luckily got to work from home uh, I was basically a, a manager for a call center so um, you know pretty pretty straightforward sometimes stressful but pretty straightforward uh role and you know everything seemed good and then one day on a monday i came in and i was told that uh, i no longer had a position and that i was being let go and you know there was no real reason just kind of a change of scenery right so um that being said that happened probably the end of november so i had already actually been here for a month and a half or two months um, and I guess to just backtrack on what my initial plan was, uh, I moved here to save money, um, as many of us are out there, especially those of us that are on their own, you know, just a single income, renting, you know, the, the usual type of stuff. Uh, it's pretty hard to get by. Basically, you make, you make enough to pay your bills and not much else. Uh, so I'm, I fall into that category. Um, but you know, it is what it is. I'm used to it because that's always been the case. So that being said, um, you know, in September, just past September, right before I moved, I turned 37, you know, not extremely old, but you know, getting to that point where I'm approaching 40 and just kind of dawned on me that I've done literally nothing in my life outside of the ordinary that I want to do you know, always in the, it's not the right time kind of mind frame or got to wait until it's more convenient or I can afford it or whatever. And I just got tired of waiting. So basically I bought myself uh, what's called an I disappear pass for Metallica, who many of you know is my all time favorite band um, with the anticipation of following them on their North American tour in 2024, which of course now is this year. Of course, when I bought that ticket, it was December of 2022. So it was still quite a ways away. Uh, but my plan was to go move here where I can spend less money on monthly bills so that I actually have the opportunity to save for my trip because it wasn't going to happen in the situation I was in. Uh, so that being said, that led to pretty much everything that has affected this channel as well. Um, I sold everything that had any value, and that included my drums, just to put in savings to put towards a trip. Um, because, you know, it's just one of those things. In order to make something happen that I can't afford to do, I have to sacrifice other things. And I'm okay with that. The problem, of course, now is that I don't currently have a job. Um, so saving money has become quite an issue um so you know there's the the kind of the mental drain of that but at the same time i'm in a new area and it's a very small town so i also have that that feeling that nagging feeling in the back of my head saying like i don't want to start something that could potentially be long term in a small town because work travels fast and i don't want to burn bridges and so the fact that you know i'll be going on my trip in six months or so yeah it's a ways away but in in reality for something that i'm serious about six months is barely scratching the surface of of establishing myself and so i don't want to start something that could potentially be you know very beneficial or very long term for me 
just to walk away because I'm I've made up my mind I'm not letting life throw a curveball more curveballs at me my trip is planned my trip is paid for outside of you know gas and food and other expenditures so I still definitely need to save a lot of money but I've literally bought my tickets I've bought my hotels I bought flights if necessary I have a reliable vehicle that I'm gonna planning to drive a large majority of it so like I'm I'm all in so at this point it's just a matter of getting to that point so that's kind of what's led to you know my recent string of videos playing through rock band songs you know I'm, I'm kind of you know I'm, I'm kind of in a position of feeling a little stuck um, I found myself kind of reinvigorating my interest in playing rock band because while I was playing drums and uploading drum videos on my channel um, I've been obsessed with rock band since it came out in 2007 um, you know to the point of being annoying like anytime I would go to a friend's house or they would come to my house my only thought would be let's play rock band um, of course when I started playing you know real drums and even the electronic drums I found myself not enjoying rock band as much because every time I played artificial music I just would have rather play real music um, so that being said now that I no longer have any real instrument to play I have kind of gravitated towards back to rock band not drums just because it's not the same um, but I've always been a fan of, of trying to play the guitar um, even doing the vocals but you know I'm not I'm out of practice I'm not about to share that so I figured the guitar you know what I have a ton of songs that I've built up uh, in my collection from from the drum videos and, and streams and stuff like that. So I'm going to challenge myself to try to play all the way through on guitar, every single song I have. I'm going to fail a lot, I'm going to just be terrible at others. Um, I'm not doing it for high scores, I'm just doing it to, to play it. Uh, so I started doing that and then I thought to myself, you know, if I had a way of easily streaming this or recording this I might as well share it right you know I I don't want to be completely inactive on my channel but at the same time I, I want to be transparent to say that honestly I got nothing going on right now and it's you know kind of a kind of a depressing time so you know I want to use it as a way to stay engaged uh, as a way to stay active because I don't know when and if I will be able to get drums in the future or if I'll be in a place where I can play them even. Um, and then I guess best slash worst case scenario, when I go on my trip, um, I'll be leaving basically uh, the first the first show is the first weekend of August. So I'll be leaving right at the tail end of July to start my road trip. So I don't know, I haven't decided all I have is my phone. I don't have any money to invest in GoPros or any, you know, streaming, uh, vlogging type cameras. It's literally just my phone. So yes, it's possible to do something like that, but I just, part of me just wants to enjoy the trip. The other part is like, you know what? I've been building up to this. It'd be kind of cool to, to share the experience because I'm literally going to be out and about for two months. Like it's, it's a pretty significant, uh, pretty significant outing which is which is why it's become so important to me but um, I'm undecided you know I might do something with that I might not so I don't necessarily want to set any expectations one way or the other but you know I just I just for anybody who cares I just want to make sure that you guys know that I haven't completely disappeared off the face of the earth although you know stuck here in my basement in my in my dungeon as I like to call it uh, sometimes it feels like that but you know this is kind of I guess my way selfishly as well to uh, remind myself to stay in contact with people other than my four walls um, so yeah that's that's basically where we are uh, I didn't mean for this to be 99.9% .9 of a depressing video but I just wanted to to kind of share you know some of my struggles because I know that uh, there's more people out there that are having similar or worse struggles than you know than I can count I'm sure like I would assume there's a lot but there's probably even more than I would assume so uh, I'm not at all 
not at all looking for a pity party. It's more of a just kind of where things are at, you know, why I kind of disappeared for a while and, you know, you're you're seeing my face here and there and and uh yeah, kind of that's kind of where we're at. Oh, and as a side note, I bought those aerodromes and I uploaded Black Diamond with the anticipation of kind of resuming the drum videos and This is not a review. This is not a an official description of the product because for what it is, it's really cool. But for me personally, I hate it. So I won't be doing it again. So that being said, I just wanted to be transparent about that as well. And uh, yeah, no real reason needed, you know, nothing wrong with it just personally it's not for me so that being said um i hope you're all doing well you know thanks for listening to my rant or whatever you might have heard of it and uh yeah i'm gonna continue just uh i guess recording myself going through my rock band songs rock band catalog um you know check it out if you want don't you know i'm just kind of doing it to occupy my mind with something so um that being said Thanks again. Talk to you guys later. Uh, happy belated New Year. I know it's been a couple weeks, but yeah, you know, still the same month, so I guess it's close enough. And uh, yeah, we'll talk to you guys next time. See ya.